An outlander. Chieftain of a Warak. It's stranger in the cut than I thought. You're telling me. You fight well. I am a Kree. Thank you. I'm Aloy. I heard the White Teeth were missing two hunters. You look like you could leave if you wanted to, so... I stayed because of the other. My Len. She snapped her leg descending the ice. I bided my time keeping vigil, but now she must return to the Werak before they leave. You know this My Len well. Since our knees were always skinned. All my life. In a test to prove that we only need ourselves. That was my weakness. Sounds like she was lucky for your weakness. That's not the way she sees it. Is joining the White Teeth so important to you? It's one of the great Weraks of Banor. Not so many great ones left now. I would go where my land went. I was her shadow on the snow and she was mine. To be a runner with the White Teeth was everything to her. What's this ordeal supposed to prove? That we have the strength of our ancestors. That we can survive as they did. And they came in search of a homeland. Some were trapped against this glacier by a snowstorm. Four days, four nights. After the storm cleared, the survivors sighted a tall neck, which led them up into Banor. Well, that's the story I learned anyway. Mylan won't let you help her, will she? because of the rules of this test. You're quick as a rock fall. No, just used to being told what's forbidden to me. She won't allow it. Won't take the medicinal plants I found or the food. Only what she can scrape up on hands and knees. I could get close when she was delirious. But now she's learned not to let me get close. So let's get her back to the work. All right. I've made a splint for her leg. Medicine for the pain, but I should warn you, she won't take them willingly. The law of survival... Tribal law shouldn't keep us apart from the ones we care for. Even if she cares more for the law. <laughs>